Hey there, PowerPoint lovers. Want to create a stunning six-step circular infographic in just a few minutes? Well, you're in the right place. In this tutorial, I'll walk you through a fast and easy way to design an eye-catching infographic that will make your presentation stand out. Let's dive in. Right-click on the slide and choose Format Background. Click Color, then More Colors and go to Custom. Set the RGB values to R, 52, G, 66, B, 75. For a sleek and modern look, a dark background makes your graphics pop. Now, let's create the base for our infographic. Go to Insert, Chart, Pie, then select Donut. Excel will pop up, don't worry, we just need to tweak a few things. Change the first cell value to 1. Drag it down to 8 rows and close Excel. Delete the data labels to keep it clean. Now, let's fine-tune our chart to make it look even better. Right-click the chart and go to Format Data Series. Set Donut Explosion to 7 and Donut Hole Size to 32. Here's where the magic happens. Right-click the chart, select Cut. Then go to Paste Special. Choose Picture, Enhanced Metafile, and hit OK. Now, right-click the image and ungroup it twice. Boom! It's an editable shape. Remove the outlines to keep it sleek. Select All Shapes, go to Shape Format, Shape Outline, No Outline. Group all shapes using Ctrl plus G. Duplicate the grouped shape, hold Shift plus Ctrl and drag. Ungroup it and delete the bottom two segments. Go to Shape Format, Merge Shapes, Union to join the remaining shapes. Next, draw a new circle on top of the duplicate. Select both shapes, go to Align, Align Center to position them perfectly. Set the circle to no fill so we can create a cutout effect. Finally, select both shapes, go to Merge Shapes, and choose Intersect. Time to bring this design to life with colors and effects. Place the intersected shape on top of the donut shape. Select both shapes, go to Align, Align Center to position them perfectly. Ungroup the donut shape and delete the bottom two segments so we can edit the individual pieces. Use the eyedropper tool to apply colors. I've got a pre-made palette, but you can use your own. Select each shape. Go to Shape Format, Shape Effects, Shadow, and apply a shadow effect. Repeat this step for all shapes to enhance the depth. Right-click the overlapping shape, go to Format Shape, and change the color to black. Set transparency to 85% to create a realistic 3D effect.
Select all shapes, group them, Ctrl plus G. Then go to Shape Format, Align, Align Center and Middle to keep everything perfectly positioned. Let's add some extra elements to make the infographic pop. Draw a small circle and adjust its height and width as needed. Remove the outline and change its color to match your design. Duplicate the circle, make it slightly smaller, and change its color to match the background for a layered effect. Select both circles, go to Align, Align Center and Middle, then Group to keep them together. Duplicate this grouped shape six times and evenly place them around the donut shape. Why do this? These circles act as placeholders for numbers, icons, or text, making your infographic more visual and engaging. We're almost there, just a few final tweaks. Ungroup the small circles so we can change the background colors. Use the eyedropper tool to pick darker shades from the donut shape. Select all six background circles, go to Shape Format, and click Send Back. Finally, add your text. To save time, I'll use text from a previous design, but you can customize it with numbers or icons. Now, let's bring the design to life with seamless gear animations. Go to Insert, Icons, then search Fort Gear in the search bar. Select two gear icons. Position them in the middle of the donut and adjust their size, color, and rotation to fit the design. Ungroup the gear icons, then group them again individually to ensure smooth animation control. Select one gear icon, go to Animations and choose Spin. Open the Animation pane, right-click the gear animation, and select Effect Options. Under the Timing tab, set Duration, Very Slow. Repeat, until end of slide. Click OK to save the settings. Change Start on Click to After Previous for automatic movement. Use Animation Painter to copy the effect to the second gear. Modify the effect options of the second gear. Change Clockwise to Counterclockwise for a realistic motion effect. Change Start on Click to With Previous so both gears rotate together. And that's it! You've just created a stunning, animated six-step circular infographic in PowerPoint fast and easy. Did you find this tutorial helpful? Let me know in the comments! Want more awesome PowerPoint tricks? Don't forget to like this video. New here? Hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a tutorial. Try experimenting with different colors, effects, and animations to make your infographic even more unique. I can't wait to see what you create. See you in the next video. Happy designing!